Well, it is approximately nine o'clock at night. It's Monday, December the 19th, I believe. And uh, I checked one trail camera today. Um, and I got two bucks on it and a couple does coming in consistently. The bucks are coming in whatever time of day. It doesn't matter, middle of the day, afternoon, morning, nighttime, they're all over the place. But uh, they're not very big. One's a four pointer, one's an eight pointer. He looks like he's a two and a half year old and uh, you know he might turn into something good in the next couple years. So those two bucks I don't really want to hunt. I'd like to leave them, uh, let them grow. I've already shot a deer this year, so I don't really want to shoot another small buck. Um, but there is one really nice deer that I've been watching. I've had pictures of him throughout the fall. And um, honestly, I don't think he's very old either. I think he's three and a half, which almost it's, it's almost a shame to shoot him right now because I think he might turn into something really big. But uh, he's a really nice deer right now, and he's the biggest one I have on camera. So... It's really my only option to hunt. I don't have a, a doe tag. So um, anyway, I'm gonna go check the trail camera um, where he's been showing up and see if he's been back around. And if he has, then I'm gonna try and come up with a plan on when I should hunt. And uh, I've just been getting so frustrated. I don't know. He, he comes in daylight, but he's so sporadic. Like he'll just, it's random like every 10 days, every two weeks he'll come once and that's it. He, he's on no type of pattern. I don't know where he stays. And I mean, I would love to go just tromp around in the woods and see all the sign in the snow and where the deer are hanging out in their bedding and you know, see if I could pattern them a bit more. But I just, I really don't want to go walk around in there, spread a bunch of scent around and let them know that I'm hunting them. Um, I just, I want them to keep moving in daylight, but uh, it's also driving me nuts too because I don't know when I should go hunt and I can't hunt every single day. So it's just really frustrating. I really want to get this deer and it'd be really sweet to do it with the bow and the snow and everything. But you know, that's hunting for big bucks. It's tough. Uh, it'd be my biggest deer if I shot this one. But uh, anyway, I'm going to go check the trail cam now and we'll, we'll see if he's there. Well, I just got back and I checked the card um, from my other spot and I actually had a bit, really big uh, surprise. It wasn't the nine pointer that I've been seeing regularly but I have another buck that's almost the exact same size as him but it's an eight pointer. I almost mistaked him for the same deer but the eight pointer is a little bit smaller. His brow tines are a little bit closer. He doesn't have quite as much mass and uh, obviously he's only got eight points. But um, so I'll show you pictures of all these deer that I've been talking about. But uh, that's a nice surprise, except he hasn't been there in daylight. He's been there in the middle of the night. Um, but he has been coming. Uh, he has came both nights in a row since he showed up on the card. He showed up on uh, Sunday night and um, last night. Both really early in the morning, though, around 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning. So, I don't know. That gives me another option. He's a, he's a shooter for me, so... We'll see. See if he keeps coming and maybe in the next uh, couple weeks here he'll um, slip up and I can give him an arrow. That'd be nice. <laughs> so this deer here is the biggest deer that I have pictures of. Um, he'd be the main one that I'm after. I think he's three and a half. He's the nine pointer that I was talking about. Um, I've had pictures of him throughout the year which is uh, what you're looking at now. Um, the latest picture will be this one right here. I got these pictures of him actually the day after I got pictures of him a kilometer and a half away the afternoon before. I didn't think he'd travel that far this late in the season. Now when I first looked at the card I thought this was the nine pointer but as you'll see the brow tines are a little closer, he doesn't quite have as much mass and uh, he does only have eight points. As I went through the pictures, I realized that. So I've never had pictures of this deer before. He just popped up. I don't know where he came from. But uh, he's another one that I would shoot if he came out in front of me. So it's good to have another one like that around. Now here's one of the small eight-pointers um, I've got on camera. 
I think this is the same deer that goes to my other spot as well. I think I have pictures of him during the day and they're coming up right now. Um, I think this is at the other spot. I think it's the same deer. He likes to hang around this little four pointer. 